Hi everyone. Today we will do math. So let's see what is the topic. So the topic is introduction to Roman numerals. Now today we are having our tutor Yognya. So now let's see the contents. So the contents are history, science, rules, activities, math talk, and summary. Now let's see the history of Roman numerals. So this is a place in Rome. Now let's see the history. Roman numerals follow the history of ancient Rome itself. From its early stages, the Latin Palatine Hill in 8th and 9th century BC to its fall in 2nd century AD, from civil war, plagium, civil apathy, and the rise of Christianity and Northern European powers. This, this tells us that Roman numerals were written from ancient Rome. Now let's see the signs. So, I stands for 1, V stands for 5, X stands for 10, L stands for 50, C stands for 100, D stands for 500, M stands for 1000. If you write these in a snort book, you will remember it. Now, let's see the rules. There is no zero in the Roman system. I, X, C, M can be repeated only three times. V, L, D cannot be repeated. If we keep any smaller letter on the left, it means subtracted. And if we keep any letter on the right, any letter, it can be big or it can be small. But if we keep any letter on the right, it means we are adding it. Now let's see the example. In it we are having 4 here. So and here they are writing it IV. In, in this I see I. I is smaller than V and it is keep on the left. Right? Right? It is kept on the right. See it is kept on the right. Which means criss cross and minus. Now V minus 1 is IV which is 4. 5 minus 1 is equal to 4. Now we have to see V not 4. So we have to see 40. So, 40 means XL. Why XL? Because L minus X is equal to 40. 50 minus 10 is equal to 40. Now, in 89, did you notice that smaller letters are written on the right? Which means adding L plus X plus X plus X. Which means 50 Plus 10, plus 10, plus 10, 80. Now, this is an activity. We have to match the mermaids with the fishes. Now, we are having here 5, 8 and 9. 5, 8 and 9. Yeah. So, in 5, 8, 9... We know 89, which is L, X, 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 I, X. First, we have to see the starting number, which means this number 5. five it, is, it has a place value of 500, so it is 500. 500 is D. So, we have to see if any of the fishes are having D. Yeah, this is having D. So, we have to match this moment with this fish. Now, this, as we know first, we have to see the first one, which is 2. 200 means 
So, C plus C is equal to 200 means 100 plus 100. So, where are we having C, C? So we are having C here. We are having C. But we are having here C and here X. So, they should go here. Now, this. Here we are having C and here also C. So, this should go here. Now, in the next slide, we'll have the answers. Wow, our answers are correct. Superb. In this activity, we have to match the students with their seats. So, we are having here 900. Just take, yeah. I am taking red color and showing you. In 989, we have to see 9. Right? Now in 9, C, S, they have written CC, CM, BCC. What will be here? 1000 minus 100, right? Means CM. So, I, I will mark this. I have marked this style with red. So, I will mark this. With red. I will take black color. Or else, yeah, blue. Now, we will do this girl. In this girl, the first one is 7. Which, which is BCC. It means 500 plus 100 plus 100. So, I will mark this with blue color. Now, I am taking yellow color. I am marking this child. Now, what is 8 here? 1000 minus 100 plus 100 minus 100 100 plus 100 so here we are having ccm so this will be correct so now let's see the answers remember this girl this now let's see will they go to our benches so they have gone to my bench so They have gone to our benches. I just erase it. Then. Okay. They have gone to the benches that we marked. Wow. Our answers are correct. See. He is sitting in the yellow one. She is sitting in the red. And she is sitting in the blue one. Wow. We have done all correct activities. Now let's have some math talk. This is a clock with Roman numbers. Now, if you have seen a clock with Roman numbers, you may have realized that the number 4 is written like this instead of this. Do you know why? Yeah. This is because it adds symmetry to the clock face. This is because it adds symmetry. The clock also has symmetry, right? So, this adds symmetry to the clock face. Wow! It's already summary time. So, we learned the following. The Roman numeral signs are I... I stands for 1, V stands for 5, X stands for 10, L stands for 50, C stands for 100, D stands for 500, and M stands for 1000. V, L, D cannot be subtracted or repeated. Every number can be repeated only 3 times. Now the next one. If we keep any smaller number on the left, it means we need to subtract it. If we keep any number on the right, it means we need to add it. 
so i now this is the end of our video now let's see the some pics from the lesson see these are the some it's these are bone like structures having roman numerals right what can you guess what are these having yep it's having 13 it's 13 and these are the these are the coins of romans thanks for watching bye